everybody, it's Aaron Deer with Quinn from Countryside Acres, and we are back at her again. We are uh, mowing hay today for another guy yesterday. Did some bailing here. If you can see any bales, if you have the windows, they're out there. Did some bailing here yesterday. He had cut his own. Uh, this morning he called and asked if I could finish cutting this field, and there's a few other fields as well. So we will do that. I also cut for the neighbor on the other side here. And uh, round bailed there. That's where he got a hold of me, I guess, and asked me if I could uh, finish bailing this for him because his baler broke. Um, so, yeah, that's what we're at again. Got a 10 foot John Deere disc over there, pulling with a 90 horse uh, Case International tracker, and uh, just enjoying that. So, I'm going to give you some shots next door. They're busy um, uh, making bales. Actually, they're pulling it with horses. These are Amish people and uh, they're pulling their power unit with the horses and then um, they're running a baler on a Honda, a Honda engine and then uh, putting it on regular bales, so a regular wagons. So small square baling. He also has a round baler that's actually with rope, a round baler that he pulls with horses as well. So uh, kind of neat. It's a mix of old and new uh, all together in the same thing. So I'll show you some shots of that as well. Yeah, just keep a hold of his shell. There you go. Easy. Okay, bring, bring it here so Easy can see. Hold on. See, that's a turtle. Nice, eh? It's over here looking on the back. Yeah. He got the hard shell. That's neat, eh? Yeah. Can you show Eli? Now go to the back. Can somebody open the door? Yeah. Pretty neat, eh? You want to see Eli? Just stick him in the water. Well, that's where he's going. He's going to the ditch into the water there. Now bring him back in. They can swim. That's neat, eh? Yeah, stuck in the weeds. That's how I call him. All right, let him go. Gentle. There he goes. He's swimming, huh? Is he? He's in there somewhere. You can see him kind of bobbing around.
zoomed way in, so it's a little bit blurry, and I'm shaking around a bit because uh, a slight movement means a big movement there. We got a four horse hitch pulling a baler, a square baler, and then there's a Honda or some sort of motor mounted to that square baler, and that's what's running it. And then, of course, the uh, gentleman's stacking the bales behind. It's a mix of old and new combined in the same field there, folks. Kind of neat. Not something you see every day necessarily. At least I don't. They do a fair bit of their own work, but they do hire out lots as well. I did a lot. I cut all that in that field there as well, actually. Uh, which is good for us doing a bunch of custom mowing. Here they come circling around. So one fella running the team, probably the motor as well. And then uh, one fella stacking bales. They had a couple more out there yesterday. Giving some instructions. And away they go again. Pretty neat. I know our son Wes would really like to work with horses and maybe something we'll look into one day. But I prefer my air-conditioned cab. Pretty cool. You like your tent, Buttercup? Huh? Do you like under there? <laughs> You're quite the character, my girl. Hmm? Do you like it under there? I think so. You look happy enough. <laughs> Don't ya? Look how much they're drinking, eh? <laughs> Look at you go. Good job. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, Whoop. eighteen. That's your birthday. How many days? Seventeen. Is that special? When did you think your birthday was? Is that why you're crying? Well, you thought your birthday was in six days, right? Yeah, but it's not. It's in 17 days. <laughs>